Oh man, so a good day for Koti now, which is pumping up and is about 30% off some of its recent lows. And is this a sign that now Koti is starting to move? As you guys know, we've been covering Koti for a while now, along with Cardano, and both of those have had a good move today. Again, we've seen a bunch of you know high profile crypto influencers jumping on the bandwagon like they did for Phantom. They'll do the same and make videos today and tomorrow about Cardano and Koti when they weren't talking about it when they were supposed to be talking about it so that you could buy on the dips luckily for you guys we've been covering these projects on this channel uh, and we will not just you know we will remind let me share the charts here let's see if i can show you the charts there we go so we were, you know, we were talking, we were covering Koti for the longest period of time from this cup and handle pattern, which you could see, we saw the breakout, we we went on this whole journey all the way up to 66 cents, and then we had our bleed down, bleed down to the downside. Now, these are where the dips were to be bought. Remember, we said we had a bunch of different buy zones, the most recent of which was around, you were picking up Koti, if you're following these videos, around 29 cent Koti's here, guys. And now we're sitting at 37 cents. We've just now breaking out from this longer term resistance level you can see this white line draw down here let me just draw over it see this white line here is our major long-term resistance and now we're finally starting to get the breakout here on this daily candlestick suggesting we could be getting some interesting move to the upside shortly you guys remember i've said for the longest period of time that Koti, even though it's a standalone project, even though it's its own thing, is going to move in correlation with Cardano. You have to remember, Cardano announced Koti as the official issuer of the JED token. The JED token is the algorithmically backed stablecoin of choice on the Cardano network. It's going to be the biggest and from the start, the only algorithmically backed stablecoin on the Cardano network. This is huge. And you can pay your fees, right, your gas fees in Ethereum in JED tokens. I'm going to come on to this because this is big and people you know i kept saying this when we bounced off of 66 cents to me it didn't make sense because we were st we couldn't even break 66 cents despite this news which is the biggest news Cody could have ever had so that is why i know all that un up all unbaked potential is still sat there in Koti and it's yet to be realized and the reason this continued to went on a bleed is exactly what I said because Cardano went on a horrible bleed as well look how similar those chart patterns are now we're getting the breakout here from this long-term resistance line on Cardano and Koti is moving in a similar manner now don't forget we have to caveat all of this because I'm going to talk about a lot of positive things about Cardano and Koti we have to caveat this with the situation we're currently facing on Bitcoin let's be realistic we're still struggling here on bitcoin could we see further downside risk i've shared in my previous videos today that on our weekly candles we are bearish now and technically in a bear market here on bitcoin which has closed weekly candles two consecutively two consecutive weekly candles below our ema ribbon so i have to bring that to your attention guys but today cardano's on a big move to the upside and Koti similarly is moving to the upside you can see here on the weekly chart for Koti, you can see this just in essence all this was was a nice retracement from 66 cents and collecting support off its ema ribbon right in the long run we never even flipped bearish in this whole move uh, which is very positive for Koti. and moving back to the day chart you can see here now can we flip this is the key now can we flip our daily EMA ribbon. We need another couple of strong days. Ideally, we got to get to uh, above 43 cents here, which is the most important point here for us in the short term in order to create a high above this high. And then we can start moving onwards, okay, here on Koti. You can also see if I put this, uh, if you take the 43 level, you are creating a bit of, uh, let me remove the EMA ribbon to make it clearer. You are creating a bit of a W pattern here at the 43 level okay so if we can get to the 43 neckline and break to the upside we could have some strong momentum pushing us through to higher targets through 49 and 50 cents so definitely something to be keeping an eye on but the reason the market is so excited right now is simply because Koti is the issuer of the jet token which we've spoken about for a while and if i just zoom out slightly so you can see the the whole thing you can see here that what happens is we, the the difference between a cardano and ethereum is charles hodgkinson has designed cardano such that you can pay your gas fees in any cryptocurrency you want and naturally people are going to want to do that with the only and the best algorithmically stable uh stable coin on the network and you know cardano has picked picked Koti as the issuer of this jet token now follow this through when you pay your gas fees there will be mint and burn fees every time jet is issued those mint and burn fees will be 
in Ada, but then will be converted into Koti and placed in the Koti treasury. So if you hold Koti and you stay Koti, you will get a portion of this treasury of everybody's minting and burning fees as a reward for staking your Koti. Huge. Now, why is it people suddenly realize this? Well, they've not just suddenly realized this. The institutional money know this. But guess what's happening on Thursday? You're getting the launch of Sunday Swap. And yes, Koti is already integrated with Sunday Swap, with our Dan Ada Swap, uh, with our Dana, with Ergo Wallet, with Daedalus Wallet, with Uri Wallet. They've done all the work in the background. So whilst the price was bleeding and people were like, oh, why is Koti not doing anything? Why is Ada not doing anything? People were building things, you know? Cardano has had the most GitHub uh, commits versus any other blockchain right now. They're having the most developer activity. We covered that in the Ada video. If you haven't watched that, head over to my Ada video from earlier today and watch that. Things are looking super good over there. And naturally, that's going to correlate to Koti. And in my opinion, if, if Ada can go on a sustained run, which, by the way, I think is contingent on Bitcoin picking up a price floor and starting to head to the upside, because I think if Bitcoin starts to fall below 40, I think that can cause mass fear. We're already sitting at 22 on the fear and greed index right now but that's a separate conversation if ada can continue a, a sustained run to the upside i really think Koti can move at a multiple of the rate that cardano is moving i mean look at this as a clue for today uh, ada is 5.59 percent up Koti is almost nine percent up you see the difference guys because Koti is a smaller market cap therefore these kind of issuances these kind of fundamental catalysts the, this kind of attention is going to have more of an effect on Koti as people start to look for cardano ecosystem projects again all these youtubers who weren't covering Koti, who were not covering ada who were actually pooing on ada and spitting in my face as mm crypto would say mm -hmm. You know, now they're flocking to it, right? Now, oh yeah, we were talking about Ada, we were talking about Cardano, and then they 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 call the CEOs onto their show because they have such a big following, right? Like, where were you covering it to give people the opportunity to buy it at twenty nine cents? Where were you saying, no, this is a great project, buy the dip on these projects? And you weren't. When Cardano was at a dollar, nobody was, none of these influencers making videos saying buy this coin. But I continue to call my conviction. I continue to bring the updates to you guys, as you can see from my chart patterns. Who was making chart patterns at this point here in our lowest peak? We were. And I even said if we broke to the downside here, we'd head to 20 cents here. But thankfully, we broke to the upside, met our price target, and now we're, we are where we are here on Koti. So things are looking better now. We need this breakout. We need to close this candle above this white line, which it looks like we'll manage to do. But we need to go from strength to strength here. Okay, guys, I'm a bit concerned about buy the rumor, sell the news. So we do have to be careful. But I do see us having a good run in for the rest of the week up to Thursday, because that is when Sunday Swap gets launched. And no doubt from then... I can see Ada getting a bit of haters uh, with a bit of backlash. So guys, be prepared for it. If you're a long-term investor, it really doesn't matter, right? Buy your favorite coins at the lowest price you can, build conviction and wait. Let the world prove out the use cases for these projects. Because if you try timing the market, you're going to struggle. So if you're going to panic, right? Because you're going to buy in today, on Thursday, it's going to tank because people are going to buy the room and sell the news. Or let's say, you know, as happens with any software project, there's some bug and Card a Sunday swap goes down or Cardano struggles with some of the transactions. Which blockchain hasn't struggled? Solana struggled, Ethereum struggled, Luna struggled, every platform has struggled. What software company hasn't struggled with bugs? Apple struggles, Amazon struggles, Android struggles. It happens. It's part of it, right? So people are going to use that as FUD to try to manipulate the price. So that's why you need to have conviction. Nothing is a smooth line. Everything is up and down but over the long run when you zoom out when you go into your weekly chart where's this story going to go here on Koti and for me I think this is going to reverse we're going to break all-time highs long run and we're going to go and create new highs and if you haven't watched some of my Koti videos I suggest you go type in Koti on my channel and start watching some of those videos we really do cover off some good things from a fundamental and a technical perspective and it'll give you a good insight into how this could become even if it was just a fraction of the size of PayPal in the payment processing space uh, in the centralized payment processing space just how big a platform Koti could become not just with Cardano but just across the whole e crypto space. We also know recently that PayPal have decided to launch their own stablecoin. Whether they're going to be successful in doing so, we don't know. We know Facebook got rejected by Congress for their DM token. Will PayPal be able to do that? How will they go about do doing that? Will they partner with a company like Koti? We don't know. But all we know is these payment processing space and crypto are merging together. And that is a play that Koti is working on over the long run. As always, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you appreciate this type of content and appreciate this blend between technical and 
and fundamental analysis. Nobody brings this on YouTube from what I could find. They all focus on either technicals and never look at the fundamentals or they just look at fundamentals and they don't know how to read a chart. If you appreciate the blend between two or both of those in one concise video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe if you wanna join this channel as a member. That is your way of supporting me, but also a lot of people have been asking me, do I have a private group where you know I share signals or things like that? No, but you can become a member of this channel. You'll get a badge next to your name. You'll get access to our community thread. And in the community thread, that's where you can ask me questions on your favorite coins, your favorite crypto, even the coins we don't cover in this channel, which we don't get a chance to cover in this channel. You can head over there and ask me questions on there. As always, link in the pinned comment below will be the link to our free Discord server. Make sure you head over into there, meet like-minded people, talk all fun things crypto, tag me with any questions you have, and I'll see you in the next one.